Hi, I'm Malcolm, the developer of Freepoc Downloader, which enables you to download and install apps by Freepoc. Today I'm going to show you how to install Freepoc Downloader on your phone and your watch. It's not in the Google Play Store, so we'll get it from the Freepoc website. I'll open Chrome and go to the Freepoc Downloads page. I'll put a link in the notes to this video. And you can find Freepoc Downloader and tap on it. I get a message that it's downloaded and open. Install. And so I've installed the app on my phone. Let's now do some setup on the watch. So go to settings and scroll down to developer options. If you don't have developer options enabled on your watch, just Google how to do it. It's very straightforward. And I recommend that you connect your watch to a charger as I've done here and enable stay awake when charging. Enable ADB debugging and turn on wireless debugging. Now let me bring my phone back in and we're going to install the watch version of Freepoc Downloader using Wear Installer 2. So let me open it. If you haven't used Wear Installer 2 before, uh, there's some explanation here about uh, how things work and a video that you can watch, but we're going to step through it fairly quickly today. The first thing to do is to make sure that the IP address of your watch is entered in the space provided on Wear Installer 2's home screen. So let's just do that. You can see that the IP address is 192.168.1.222. So let's tap done. Now we need to pair the phone and the watch over ADB. So on the watch, let's say pair new device. And on the phone, from the menu, let's say pair with watch. And if you haven't done this before, there's some explanation here about how everything works, but let's tap enable. And you will see that it's asking for the pairing code and the pairing port. The pairing code here is 339668. <clears throat> 339668. Then a space, and then the pairing port is 40415. So 40415. And done. I get a message attempting to pair and then successfully paired. Now, this step is important to remember. In the port on Where Installer 2's home screen, we need to enter this number here, 40971, 40971. And now we're successfully paired and ready to go. If we look at the installed apps on the phone, we should find that Freepoc Downloader is there, and it is. If we tap on it, we get a message to say that the watch component's been extracted and we're offered the opportunity to install it. So let's tap Install. Sending the APK file from the phone to the watch over Wi-Fi and success, APK installed on watch. Now, there's one more Thing that we need to do while we're while we're here. Uh, Freepoc Downloader needs uh, a permission to install uh, new apps on the watch and we can do that directly from 
software installer too. So menu, third party apps permissions, Freepoc downloader, and send. And we've sent the command to the watch. So now we can finish. We get a message, turn off ADB debugging on the watch. That's important to remember so that we don't waste battery. So turn off wireless debugging, turn off ADB debugging, and we don't need stay awake when charging anymore. So now we have Freepoc Downloader installed both on our phone and our watch. In another video, I'll show you how to use the app on both devices. I'll include a link to that video and to my Freepoc website in the notes below. That's about it for now. Thanks for watching and see you again soon.